Golly, I forgot how bright this light was. Sheesh. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Rigo Dwayne. I'm back with another video. Finally, after so long, I think it's been about seven months now, which is crazy. I'm really disappointed in myself. I know y'all are disappointed in me too, but look, I'm with y'all. I know. But that's why I'm here. I wanted to give you guys an update on where I've been, what's been going on, why I haven't been here for months on months on months. And there's a lot of factors that play into my absence, but nonetheless, I still feel like I needed to give you guys an explanation on why I've been out this entire time. First of all, for those that have been keeping up with my channel and have been watching my videos from the very beginning, you guys know that I've came on YouTube full throttle, hoping to be one of the next big YouTubers out over time. Unfortunately, a lot of time has gone by, six years to be exact, and I've seen little, little growth on this channel. When you see very little results on the things that you enjoy doing, you come to a point where you think that this might not be panning out for you. This might not work out. And I've had outside voices tell me that too, but I'm trying not to listen to those outside voices. I don't want that to stop me from progressing in what I really and truly want to do. You see a lot of other people who come onto this platform and other platforms outside of this and they somehow, some way grow and succeed, move on to the next part of their lives after they done succeeded. But for some reason, I just can't get past that first level. Also, when you speak on time, I've seen a lot change in the world of media. Like it just evolved to something very different than what I'm used to. YouTube is not the number one platform for video anymore. That crown belongs to TikTok. And I've been on TikTok a few times here and there. I think around the same time I stopped making videos is the same time I stopped being on TikTok. When you think about how TikTok has grown to what it is now, you start seeing difference in interest from the people who watch videos you guys know on youtube on this specific channel i do sneaker content but trying to make content out of it has been the biggest challenge for me and there's a lot of people who don't really watch sneaker videos or at least sneaker youtube videos they probably might watch little videos here and there on instagram reels or on tiktok and like i said the way tiktok has grown the viewers the audience their attention spans have declined drastically because with TikTok videos, they're more known for short videos. Even though the time length limit for TikTok videos is 10 minutes, a lot of people aren't making TikToks past a minute. I recently ran a poll on my IG story and I asked if they watch Reels and TikToks and how long they would watch those videos. And my three options were 30 seconds, up to a minute, longer than a minute, and it was neck and neck between 30 seconds to up to a minute. A lot of people aren't watching anything past five minutes when it comes to YouTube. And the reason why they enjoy short length videos is because it just goes straight to the point and they can just move on to the next. So knowing that, that made me have to sit back and think even longer to figure out, okay, how do I adjust to that? Like what content can I do that's going to be great for a minute's time. And obviously I've been on Instagram. I'm not trying to sound like some old dude that doesn't be on social media. I see it all. It's just, I'm trying to figure out what I can bring to the table that'll shine or that'll stand out. But while I've been spending a lot of time thinking about that, I spent majority of my time working and the jobs that I've had through the years took up so much of my time every day. You know, just regular life shit. You got your nine to five job. But mines didn't feel like no regular nine to five. Sometimes they do, but the rest of them be feeling like all day from sun up to sundown. Putting all of my time and focus on that literally detached me from putting in the work for building a YouTube channel or build any platform that I'm on. And every day I'm at work, I don't look happy at all because it's like I'm losing my time. I'm wasting my time when I could be building something like this. And it, it was bas it was really hard to balance, basically. So with me explaining this to you all, let me update you guys on what I've been doing recently and what I'm going to be doing in the near future. First of all, I don't know if you guys recognize this chair that I'm sitting on. I just recently got this uh, earlier this year. Let me show you guys why. I now have a full-blown setup. Don't mind the wires. I'm still trying to find like a better way to organize all that, but that's what I got. 
so far and this is the way I have it. And I'm over here getting notifications on my phone, but we're gonna ignore that. Some different things have been going on since I've created this setup. For one, I did decide to start a Twitch channel and a Kick channel, not Kick Messenger. This isn't middle school. I'm talking like a new platform that is very similar to Twitch and the way that it's spelled out is literally the verb kick. I've created channels for both those platforms because I decided to bring content over there as well. I'm gonna be gaming, I'm gonna be having some chill streams, hopefully some more entertaining streams in the near future. So that's where I'll be at. I will leave links down below in the description so you guys can go check those out. I already have some content built up already on Twitch. I still have to get my kick up and running. Not only have I recently started streaming on kick and on Twitch, I also started a podcast with a group of individuals and we call it the Young and Ignorant Podcast. Not the full word ignorant. You have to add some hood black accent on there. Ignant, Young and Ignant Podcast. We've already been... Eight episodes in, we're going on nine. We do post episodes on YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter X. So I will leave links down below so you guys can go check out that podcast because that's where I'll be at. You'll see me there every week. I've really been trying to get back on the grind, y'all. I've been trying to put myself back out there on multiple platforms so I can grow as an all-around creator. Again, it is very tough trying to maintain all of these platforms, but I feel like I've been put in a position to give myself another chance. I've met some people along the way that have given me a different perspective on what I could be doing. And you know, I've been also meeting people who support me and who support what I do and they wanna grow along with me. So it's like, I just can't give up like that because if I have these people counting on me, I can only imagine how many more people will see me and feel that same way as I keep going. And that's pretty much it, man. So don't worry, y'all. I'm not going anywhere. I'm still going to be putting out videos on this channel as well as everywhere else that I'm at. So I hope you guys are still here and hopefully you guys enjoy this journey. Make sure y'all follow all of my socials so y'all can keep up with me and all my socials will still be linked down below in the description as well. And that'll pretty much do it with this video, man. Appreciate you guys for taking your time. I'm sorry that I've been gone. I'm glad you guys embrace and welcome me back, hopefully. And with all that being said, it's your boy Regal Dwayne, and I will see y'all on the next video.